in the books so far this postseason, and here we go with game number three. Tension so thick you can cut it with a knife. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Quick feed to the brink hit. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Offensive end. Detroit's got the puck against the boards. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Feeds the puck over to Raquel. With possession along the wall. Stones up with the blocker. Detroit's looking to break out. And he's ridden off the puck. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck. Great reach with the poke check. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. And that's poked away by Petrie. Fires it! Huge stop by Husso. Grabbed along the board by Hayes. And they do it again! As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Scores! Quick blast! No chance! This play does not happen without that beautiful pass, James. It's all about reading where the coverage is and knowing exactly how your teammate can skate onto that puck. And when you skate onto it, you have some speed. You can get that shot off the way you want, and he capitalizes perfectly. The Red Wings strike first here in the opening frame. A relatively early goal here in this one. Well, you can see that the team is starting to settle in, and it's typically halfway through the period when you can see who's got the legs and who doesn't. But it's been a consistent effort. Now they've got the lead. Hey, often when they get the lead, they finish the game with the lead. So it's a nice way to start the game. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Now the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. And he serves it across to Fisher. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Slides it on over to Kopp. Now a quick pass to Rasmussen. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Red Wings have taken a 1-0 lead. Wanted. Mata scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. From the point, looks to make something happen. Oh, solid save by Chari. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. The Penguins take possession off the faceoff. What a hit against the wall. He knew exactly what he was doing with that hit this early in the game. He's trying to send a message and dictate the pace. And that slides right out to center ice. Poked away in the neutral zone by Malkin. Jostled off the puck. The Penguins gain control of the puck. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Picked up along the wall by Rust. Nice zone entry on the left side. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Sometimes when you lose the puck, it's a product of trying to do too much. Sometimes keeping it simple is more effective. 
and loses possession after a solid hit. Passes up ahead from the left wing. Intercepted. The Red Wings have been stealing pucks all game, and when you intercept passes and you find ways to get your sticks in lanes, you typically find a way to possess the puck, but they've got to open it up here. This game's awfully tight. They gain the zone from the left side. And that pass attempt is deflected. Takes the feet at the back end. Huge steal in his own end. Shot! Denies him on the play! Grabs the puck in the corner. Makes his presence known on the ice. Jari's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Here in the back half of this period, Detroit's up one zip. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. What a steal in his own end. Jari's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. The centermen glide into position. Ellers won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Broken up by Graves. Quick pass over to Bovillier. And he takes the feed. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Gets the puck in deep. The Penguins have it now. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. They win the faceoff here in their own end and take possession. Passes on over to Rust. And a smart heads up play to put that away by Mata. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kopp. Excellent stick work on the play. Detroit's got control of it now from their own end. Takes the pass. Looks to make a play over to Comfort. Slides the puck to Malkin. Rust's got it on the offensive end. Quick feed to Malkin. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. The official waved this off right away. This is going to be goaltender interference. Listen, these rules are put into play to protect the goaltender. The moment you come into contact, this is going to be waved off. I know they didn't like the non-goal call, but the show must go on here. Here we go with a face-off. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. There's the whistle. Let's get the call for the officials. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum, and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. Our first opportunity to look at the power play unit set to go to work. Well, first power play of the game, James. You want to start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Keeps possession. Picked up along the boards by Graves. And that's knocked away by Sider. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Eller. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Face-off looming here on this power play. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Takes a shot! Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Detroit's working around along the line. Uses the force on that hit. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Quick feed down low. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. 
The Red Wings gain possession in their own end. Penalty expires. You really have to admire the effort of the penalty-killing unit on that one as both teams are back to even strength. Body language says it all, James. Have a look at the unit here. Every single one of them deflated. They know that they needed to score. They can't blame the goalie on this one who's tracking the puck and then all of a sudden it changes direction because it deflects off of a defender in front. Real tough puck luck. Centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. chance on this one as his teammate just makes a gift of a pass right into his wheelhouse and he just powders it by. Detroit's taking a one goal lead here in period number two. Yeah, now it's about not sitting back, not saying, hey, we've got a lead, we're going to protect it, but being aggressive and trying to go after more. Comfers won the draw here in the open ice. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Here's a short pass to Bunty. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Carlson's been on fire lately. Everything he throws at the net seems to be going in. When it's working for you, you gotta be confident. You feel like nothing can go wrong. Cut grab by Mata. And he keeps possession. Pittsburgh's got the puck. That's moved up ahead. Rocks him on the play. Sends it in on the attack. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. From the place 99 made famous. There's a great plus save by Chari. More than half the period left to play. It's 2-1. 
And he'll start with possession. Taken by Fisher. Puts it on there. Oh, it goes up the club and he keeps it out. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck now. And now he moves it quickly to Gustafson. We got a delayed penalty coming up. That trip right in front of the official's eyes. Can't get away with that. Important task for the key players ahead of them. Up by one and a real opportunity protected. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. Well, they earned this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Denies him! He shows a great goaltender who understands where the threats are, and this one's in the slot area, and he manages to get to position and make the save. Nice job to escape the zone. Scooped up along the wall by Carlson. Quick pass to Raquel. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. The top power play unit showing a little bit of frustration there as they weren't able to execute. No luck around the net. Oh, well, there's going to be a call on that one, James. Gives it right back. And he takes the dish. Penalty coming up as the play's going there. Well, the penalty killers are going to have to be the task on this one, protecting that one goal lead. Raquel 
steps inside. Takes a shot. Stopped with ease. And there's another stop. Grabbed along the board by Hayes. Denies him. This is a dialed in goaltender. Very aware. Knows where the shooter is in that low slot. And makes the save. The Penguins take possession off the faceoff. And a great save! Goaltender covers up and will get a faceoff. More than half the period has expired. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Hall's got it in the defensive zone. Gain momentum up along the side. Pittsburgh's got the puck now. Moves it to Latang. Takes the feed from the wing. Sends it over to Bunting. The Penguins take it along the wall. Picked off by Fisher. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, a clutch save! And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. Crosby's won the draw here in the offensive zone. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Inside the offensive end, now down the left. Picked up along the wall by Mott. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. And that's intercepted by Malkin. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he fans on it. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Latang stick handling in his own zone. And now it's over to Crosby. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Sends a pass over. Moves into the slot. And he opts to wait for more support. That knocks him off the puck. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Nearing the 40 minute mark of the game. Puck cleared from the defensive end. He's in. Stop. Oh, you gotta love this stuff, James. The game within the game, and this is a one-on-one -on -one battle, and this goaltender, he knows exactly where he's at, and he wins it. The Penguins start with the puck in the road end. And it's a quick pass to O'Connor. Tries to dangle, and the puck skips away. Tosses it to Debrinkit. Slides the puck over. Oh, look at this! Two periods down, one more to go. Both teams have time to get a refresh, and we'll be back for period number three. I'm fired up. I know you're fired up for this, too. Don't forget, fans, if you're here with somebody celebrating any more things like four, Welcome back, everyone. They say three is the magic number, and here we are with period number three. Who wants that go-ahead goal the most? Here we go. The puck is dropped on period number three. They score! A clutch goal gives them the lead. Well, it's very timely, isn't it, James? To give them the lead and also the confidence that they've shown these past few shifts led to that opportunity. Well, he certainly looks frustrated after letting that goal in, James. It's almost like a fielder in baseball. If you touch it, you should be able to stop it, and then he gets a big chunk of that one. Unfortunately, it goes in the netting. Detroit's on their way to victory if they can hold down this lead through the rest of the third. Well, it's all about game management, but they can't just sit back and hold on. Otherwise, their opponent, they will look to attack and they will take advantage. Put them back on their heels. Be in the offensive zone where they can't get an opportunity to attack you. He got all that hit. And now he tries to get it across to Raymond. Puts it away to keep the pressure on. Slides the puck across to Malkin. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Sider. Detroit's in transition. 
Quick feed to Malkin. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Great glove save! Still plenty of time left in this frame. The Red Wings have taken the lead here over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on it. Puck scooped up by Gustafson. The Red Wings have it behind the net. Raymond's carrying it ahead. Here's a centering pass. What a chance, but they can't connect. The Penguins have it behind the cage. Big hit, and that frees up possession. And he slides it quickly to Raquel. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Tries to feed it over to Bunty. Huge steal in his own end. Here they are on the attack. The Penguins have it against the wall. And the puck's not loose. Dishes it to Latang. Great read by Tarasenko. Big stop right there. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Looking to set up offensively. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Oh, what a hit on the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Red Wings have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. Pittsburgh's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Husso. Moves it quickly over to Kopp, and that's poked away. The Penguins take it across the line. with the time of this game, huge, Cheryl. Huge goal with respect to timing as well, James. Not only is it the equalizer, it tells me one thing. They made the adjustments that they talked about in the intermission. A great start to the third. Shot! And a big-time save on a big-time shot! Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. The Penguins win it in the defensive zone. Ajo's taking it from his own end. And he slides it quickly to Crosby. Slides the puck to Malkin. Takes a bump but hangs on. Pittsburgh's got possession of the puck. Detroit's got possession here in the neutral zone. On the attack along the boards. Now a quick pass to Dabrinkit. Great hits up play with the stick by Ajo. Graves works the puck in his own zone. And now it's grabbed by Gabrinkit. Way too much congestion blocks that. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces. On the breakaway! Makes the save! Oh, and this is a great save. You can see this one-on-one -on -one battle. And the goaltender is so dialed in, tracking and makes that save. Sends the pass down low. Dishes it off. Moves the puck. Oh, he had that corner, but he puts it off the outside of the post. Now the adrenaline's rushing. You're getting yourself to the right spot at the right time with an opportunity to go ahead in the game. And it hit the 
the post and out. Turning to the front of the net. And that shot gets blocked by one of his own teammates. My goodness, they are really starting to tie up the pressure here now. And there's a little physicality. And there's the whistle icing the call. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Pittsburgh's won the draw, no goal to work. Puck possession right off the draw, James, against a very tired group who just iced the puck, leads to an opportunity. Oh, he just got enough of that one to keep it out. Laying the body. The Penguins looking against the half wall. Quick pass across to Valeno. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. The Red Wings move it ahead. There's the whistle as the puck goes up and over the glass. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. The Red Wings get a hold of the draw. And we got a delayed penalty coming up here. Good fight for the puck along the boards. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, the coach doesn't like this call at all. It's late in the third period. Game is tied, and he's letting the official know it. He's also saying, you better even this up. <laughs> Detroit's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. They clear the zone. And now he moves it quickly to Comper. Sends it in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Glass is ready for the faceoff as they'll continue to kill off this penalty. The Penguins come up with the defensive zone draw. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Passes it over to Sider. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Great positioning in the defensive end. And the puck's kicked free. Picked up along the boards by Dabrinkit. Poked away in the defensive end. Looking to set up offensively. Here's a chance. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Husso. Toss up the puck after that hit. Here's a short pass to Dabrinkit. The Penguins take it along the wall. Can't hang on after that hit. Slides the puck across to Dabrinkit. Oh, just wide. I think he was feeling the pressure there, Jamie. Works hard to get to good spot on the ice. He's got a huge scoring chance, and he's unable to hit the net. He was just a little tight on the stick there, and it went wide. Sends it into the offensive zone. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Beats it over. Stones him in front. Listen, Jamie, the shooter's in the slot. This is as high danger as it can get, and he challenges. Set, ready to go in great position and makes the save as a result. Here in the later stages of this period, we got a tie game. Nearing the final minute of regulation. Slides the puck ahead to Rust. Take it along the wall by Edmondson. Slides it diagonally to Comfer. The Red Wings move the puck in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Kane. Nice dish from the left wing. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Moves it to Pedersen. Carlson's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. Nice zone entry from the left. Great reach with the poke check by Edmondson. Avoids the poke check. Moves the puck along the half wall. Glove save. 
We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. And off the draw, they win possession. Puck grab by Hayes. Nice zone entry from the middle. Easy save by Husso. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Well, there you go. We played 60 minutes of regulation hockey, and we still don't have a decisive winner, so we're going to get a little bonus time. It's overtime. Buckle up. Get ready, because OT is next. Hard to find a more exciting stretch in any part of sports. Overtime. Let's go. Puck is dropped on overtime. Let's find out if there's any heroes out there. Quick shot, and that's blocked away. Works it across to Raymond. And it's a quick pass to Debrinkit. And he slides it quickly to Sider. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. Back at the point, they set it up. The Penguins have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Great pass from off the right side. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Sends it quickly to Larkin. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Moves it over to Malkin. Takes the feed in center from the right wing. Taken by Crosby. For the win! Oh, we are still tied! What a stop! A critical draw here. And they win the draw here in their own end. He says, let's get physical on that play. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Great defensive effort with the stick. Puck picked up by Bunting. Pass to Pedersen. There's another hit on the play. He's going to feel terrible tomorrow, James. Over and over again, he's been throttled. Puck knocked loose after that hit. And that goes off course off a of body. Takes the feed at the point. And it comes up with the save. Here they come on the attack. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. On the attack, they come down the right wing. The Penguins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Quick feed to Eller. And now he angles it across to Bunting. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Moments away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. Face-off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Moves it around along the half wall. Eller's moving it ahead. Knocked off the puck. Detroit's got it behind the net. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. Whistle blown, stopping the play. So frustrating to take a penalty in overtime with the game-winning goal looming. Now the 18 penalty killers have to come out and do a job. Check. And the puck clears the zone. Detroit's got it along the wall. Fires it on net. Turned aside with the glove by Jari. Hope everyone's 
enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Takes a lot, but still hangs on. Sometimes you don't get the bounces in a game, and right there, a huge opportunity to convert, but hits the crossbar and out. Game is still tied. And a good save on the play as action continues. With possession along the wall. The Red Wings can't take advantage of the open. There it is! They score and win it in overtime! Well, you create offense by moving the puck, and that's exactly what he does here. He knows how to manipulate his opponent to open up the lane, but it's all about the pass. It's got to be on the money if you want to do something with it. continue to ramp up in the next playoff game and we will see you all then here at EA Sports.